Well, hi there. We're doing two unboxing videos today. I just opened up a package I got from the Goulet Pen Company. And yeah, really impressed with their packaging, really cool. So if you haven't seen that video, feel free to check it out. I'm filming this one literally immediately after finishing that one. I'm too excited to wait. So <laughs> here we go. Alrighty. What do I have here? I have the Conklin Duragraph. Provided everything was picked right, this should be the forest green in medium. Retailing about $52, I want to say that's what I spent on it, so, you know, I'd kind of consider it not quite a beginner's pen, but not quite advanced either. Let me rephrase that, not quite intermediate either. So, it's kind of in that borderland. Um, yeah, I've never bought one of these before, so I don't really know what to expect. It's a, just a plastic plastic cover, kind of like a pencil case. Like, you remember those cheap pencil cases you bought in, uh, for, like, elementary school stuff? Yeah, that's what that feels like to me. Really liking the logo and everything through the window. That's cool. All right. Hold on, I just want to do that again. Tip, tip. Shing. It's like unsheathing a sword of awesomeness. All right, so this is actually one of the neater packages I've seen. Um, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder if this is imitation leather or if it's actually genuine. I have no idea. Feels, feels like the real deal though. Feels like real leather to me, so. Wooden box, ooh. Look at that, we're gonna try to fix the focus there. Well, they couldn't have done that any better, could they? Well, that's an attractive package. <clears throat> Something to be said about that simplicity right there, just having it sitting right, right in there. Pull it out. It's got a nice feel to it, too. Of course, the medium is, uh, oops, sorry. Two-tone. Medium is two-tone. See some oil on there, so... Alas, I don't think there's going to be any filling video today. Pretty sure I'm going to end up flushing this out with some soap first. So, twist converter. Super comfortable with that. How many Lamy pens I own, I better be. It's a decent sized converter, too. Man, oh man, though. This dark green, this kind of forest green favorite color though in the world and that is just mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. that is something all right what else we got <laughs> that popped out of the back oh look at that So some instructions on how to fill. Looks like some company history. Collectors Club and warranty. Ooh. Thumb tweaked out there, sorry. Okay, so gotta keep proof of purchase around for that uh, warranty. Don't forget that. And I saw, ha, ah, something about that. <clears throat> okay, so just international short cartridges, I guess. That's pretty cool. Looks like a black and a blue. Nice. Very nice. That's awesome. <clears throat> now, 
you probably couldn't see it, but the interior, there we go. The interior of the box here is actually super, super nice as well. I think that's kind of a, I don't know, it feels like felt. Not 100% on that, but it feels like felt. Definitely cardboard inside. Really most of this is just wrapped cardboard, I'm pretty sure, but the packaging just looks phenomenal. Look at that. Look at that. Alrighty guys, that was the Conklin Duragraph. Hopefully you'll see a review coming of this eventually. I try to take some time with them, a prolonged amount of time, um, just to get a feel for them. So, yeah, I'm eager though.